stunner, nigga. Rich gang, 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 Boy, what the hell are you doing in here throwing up sex? You ain't got no job. What's good, NSG Squad? This is your boy, NSG One Mike, and welcome back for another video. B, man, it's been a minute. Actually, it's been a long time I uploaded a video. But I'm going to start off the new year. Well, I'm going to start off the 2024 year. You feel me? So, if y'all can see right here, got me a new car. Now, this is a 2018 um dodge challenger um this is a what a v6 now i got this car you know basically i kind of just upgraded from a nissan central and that was a 2019 nissan central the video will be down in the description i'll just go through my channel you will see the 2019 so yeah i did an upgrade um did a do something different man my first time buying a um a dodge product well, yeah, Dodge Father, she is kind of dirty, though. But even though she is nice as hell, really, really nice. I love I love the car. I love the body work. I love the um, the look of it, man. Like, the look is just, like, look at her. She's blue. A um, lot, a lot of plans I want to do with this car. First off, I want to, you know, definitely change out the rims. I'm going to do, like, 20-inch rims on it. But these tires is huge, y'all. If y'all look at it, like, these tires is huge. Like, I couldn't believe it. Like, this damn tires is huge, though. But, um, man, coming from a 20, coming from a Central, man, this car is fast. For a V6, I never drove a V6. All my cars was mostly four cylinder, so not that fast. But I always, for some reason, I was trying to push my damn Central <laughs> to be fast as hell, but... Overall, let me let's go. Let's go inside. Oh, before we go inside, five um five percent all around, um twenty percent on the um windshield, twenty percent on the windshield, but everything is five percent. You know, I got a dog there. That's the first thing I did with the car. Um, leave it down in the comments, man. What mods I should do with the car? I'm, I'm gonna definitely do rims. I'm gonna definitely do a, um a muffler delete. I'm gonna definitely get that done. Well, let's go inside. Let's go inside real quick. So, even though it's a little dirty, but don't mind me, y'all. <laughs> so, what sold me on this car, man, was this damn, the damn, um, the look of it. Like, look at the look. I mean, this, the look of it, like, I just, this was sold me. Like, all this right here, like, yo, this is crazy. And so when I went to the dealership, let's check out the back. Stuff in the back of my baby car seat. Uh-huh. Let me roll down the window real quick. Turn that off. <laughs> roll down the window real quick. All right. But, um, so when I went to the dealership, man, I told drove a 2019... 2019 um Dodge Charger. Test drove that. I was going to get that. I was I was going to get that charger. But when I seen this um the 2018 um Challenger, I'm like, let me go ahead and test drive. Let me just see how it looks, how it feels. And for some reason, I just it, it sold me. Like it just sold me. I, I messed with it. I just love the look of it. Like I don't know, man. Like the look, just real look, real nice. So you know, dash cam. I got my little um Dragon Ball Z figures up here. Um, the the car is real nice. The car is really, really nice. I really mess with it. Um, it's fast. It's to me, it's fast. Like I just like going going on the highway and just press on it. It just push you back a little bit. So I, I like that, and you know it got sports mode. I got sports mode right here. Um, normal type drive. Now this is a base model. This is the no, you know, this is the base model. This is a um, XXT model. It's not the um, plus or anything like that. So I don't have like the safety features on this car. But even though I, I love it, I love it. But um, let me let let me. Just, I want to let y'all check out the engine real quick. Let me pop the hood. 
out the hood real quick. Let me go check out the engine. Like I said, it's a V6, but um, I'm gonna kind of get used to. Oh, I ain't popped the hood. I popped the damn trunk. I think <laughs> I definitely popped the trunk. Oh, let me pop the hood. Where the hood at? Okay, I did pop that. Okay, there you go. Uh, let's see, let's see. So, yeah, V6. Nothing too special. Um, like I said, the modification I did on here was just the tents and I changed out the light bulbs. So it's LED light bulbs. You see it? Where this ran off with LED light bulbs. Um, to be a V6, man, it's pretty fast. Like, it's pretty fast. Like I said, coming from a Nissan Sentra, this is a huge upgrade for me. So maybe down, maybe two years, three years down, I'll probably go for a Hemi. Now, I might do an RT. I'm not going to try and do a scat pack or nothing like that. Not just yet. So I'm kind of, kind of level myself when I'm doing these um, charges or challenges. So yeah, I'm mostly probably gonna do a um a um RT Hemi. But this car is nice. Like look at it. <laughs> this is nice, man. The trunk space, huge. I love the I love the trunk space. Um hold on, let me go ahead and pop this up, man. Trunk space is huge. I got all my stuff in the, in here, so yeah. <laughs> all my stuff in here. Backup camera. Um, what else? What else? What else? I can say about this car. Um, oh, gas mileage on this car? Perfect. Perfect. Um, people who's wondering how much it takes to fill up this tank is very beyond. It's, it depends where you go. If you go to BP, you might get a little cheaper gas on there. Um, mostly I go to Costco or Sands Club. They most have the good prices of gas. So, my fill up, if I got to fill up, most likely it's going to fall on $40 to 50 That's it. Now, if you go to a regular gas station like BP or anything, and the gas prices might be go, might be a little high. So you might have a, you might, you know, fill it up. You might go over, over 50 maybe hitting 60 It depends where you at. But me, I'm in North Carolina, so my gas prices is normally it's going to be around in the 40s close to 50s so yeah but the gas mileage is is good really really good for some reason every time like sometimes the gas meter will go down a little bit but when i start the car up for some reason it goes back up so oh, i'm not too sure about that y'all leave me down in the comments man what's that all about i like these i like the look of the hood even though it's kind of like a fake vent i think i think it's like fake vents it's nice it's really really nice <laughs> But yeah, man, 2018 Dodge Challenger, my first Dodge product I ever bought. Um, modification, like I said, leave it down in the comments where I should do a modification. Um, I need to go to the dealership and get these damn wheel locks off, though. Got the wheel locks in there, um, for some reason, they, um, and the glove department got the lug nuts, but the, the, um, the key wheel is not in there, so. I might have to ask them how to um, do they have it or do I got to break these motherfuckers off? You feel me? Because I'm trying to get the rims. I'm getting, I'm getting the rims. I'm gonna get, I don't know which one I'm gonna do. I might just do all black rims because I think it will look perfect on the car. But yeah, man, <laughs> it is nice. It is nice. This is that's what sold me for you know from a 2019 to the well from the Charger to the Challenger because I just love the look of it. It gives it gives you that um. I don't know, man. That that boss man type look, you feel me? But this car, this car is really, really nice. And what I know is about this car, lights is almost everywhere. You got lights down here, lights down here, lights on, lights on the um. When you open up the door, it's lights, lights up under here. Um, there's a light under here somewhere. But yeah, I got some good lighting up in here. I just I hate these lights. I need to change them though. But yeah, man, um, this is my new car. <laughs> this is my new car, man. My first Dodge, my Dodge product. Um, hopefully, 
in a couple more years, I might just upgrade to a Hemi. Might just start off with an RT. But right now, I'm in. I'm loving this V6. So <laughs> V6 is good. And I know a lot of people will be trashing on the V6, but for a person who comes up and do this, um, who come up from a, um, a Sentra to a Dodge, is a huge, huge upgrade for me. So yeah, man. Leave it down in the comments, man. What do y'all think about the Dodge Challenger? Do you think it's a huge upgrade for me? Let me know down in the comments. What was your experience of, you know, a Challenger or a Charger? Um, my experience with, with the Charger. Oh, look, before I end this video, man, the 2019 Charger I told you of, it was a base model. Um, nothing too special on that. It was just a regular XXT. It didn't even have sports mode. I just noticed that when I, um, I just noticed that when I, when I touch drove it and touch drove this one, I know it didn't have a um, sports mode on there, but overall, I just like the look of it. But let me know in the comments, man, what you think about the car? Do you like it? Do you love it? And what type of modification I should be doing with this car? Leave it down in the comments, okay? I already told y'all what I'm going to do. I'm going to do the muffler delete and I'm going to put some rims on there. But let me know in the comments what other, what other things I should be doing with this car, you feel me? But yeah, man, I'm going to end this video, man. This is your boy, Energy. If you want me to subscribe, comment, like, and stay tuned for the next video b i'm out of here man